Welcome to the Cherries TV. <laughs> Welcome to the Cherries TV. My name is Abby and I'm a fragrance lover. I love anything that smells, feels, and smells good. You guys, welcome back to another video about a title of this video you know is about to get down. But before we get into this video, are you subscribed to the channel? Now, if you're not subscribed to the channel, it's okay. I'll wait. Are you subscribed to the channel? All right, let's get right into this video. <laughs> if you're new here, my name is Abby, and on this channel, we talk about fragrances. Anything that has to do with smelling good, feeling good, that's what we talk about. And occasionally, we do lifestyle content. And if that sounds like something that you're definitely interested in, go ahead and grab a seat, grab a drink, hit that subscribe button, and while you're at it, put on your notifications, put it on all so that you'll be notified for every single video that I do post. All right, you guys, so today I'm about to share some fragrances that I don't think I've shared with you guys officially that are new to my collection. This is basically like a haul. So um, we're just gonna get right into it. Now, um, some of these fragrances I bought and some I got in PR. So we're just gonna go ahead and start off with the PR fragrances first, and then we're gonna work our way to the ones that I physically bought myself. So the first fragrance is one from the house of Navatus, and it is Navatus Exo Brandy. Now y'all know I am a Navatus partner, so I've worked with them several times. Now this one is from um, the recent launch of um, Navatus with Big Beard Business, and this is called Exo Brandy. It is a sexy, boozy fragrance um this is one that i would definitely wear during the fall time i picked this one out because i really love the last launch that big beard business had and this was nothing compared to the last one this is even better like what i love the last fragrances that he had so imagine this wow this is so creamy it is so nutty and it is um a lot and it's extract the perfume so they're even stronger than regular perfume fragrances and um i'm super new to it so i don't know how long it wears but if this is anything like any of the novices perfume fragrances it's gonna last long because all of their fragrances that i've had have a good eight an hour plus fragrance even the freshies this is really good um just smelling it off off rip i haven't worn it yet um officially like out but i've worn it on the skin and it smells amazing on my skin i'm really excited for this especially for the fall time um you know blink of an eye you'll see that fall is here and you're like what the heck happened to summer the next one is called imperial and this one right here is another sexy fragrance from oh my god this one is more so like um, one that I would not mind wearing right now, actually. It is more leaning towards the fall time, but it is acceptable during the spring and summertime as well, especially during the nighttime. Y'all, let me go ahead and spray this one because I remember loving this one a lot. So good, y'all. This one straight up reminds me of licorice. Y'all know I like spicy fragrances, so anything that has some spiciness in it, I do not mind. And it has some spiciness in it, and it kind of reminds me of licorice, like the black licorice, and I know no one likes that flavor, but the scent is really nice. I can't wait to play around with this. I would definitely wear this at nighttime. This one kind of does lean a little bit more masculine in my opinion, so y'all already know if I can't wear it, Mark is going to be wearing it. And y'all know I, I wear it masculinity and fragrances all the time. So I really like this one and I can't wait to play around with it. Now this one is one that Mark specifically picked out um, from them because they asked me to pick out some fragrances and um, Mark went ahead and picked this one out. And it is from one of the, it was from a previous release. I'm not sure, I'll put the name on the screen if I remember who it's from, but he picked this one out from some samples that I had and it's called creme imperial this is like the ultimate male fragrance it is not a blue fragrance but it's like very spicy and very like fresh and clean i really like this one and i've worn it myself 
it's amazing now i did get another one and it's called viva more i'll put a picture up right here but my friend came over and he smelled it and he fell in love with it but he didn't tell me his wife was like oh my god he was drooling over that fragrance so i just decided to give it to him because that's a style of fragrances that he liked now viva more if you've ever smelled hockey bot um from nishane then viva more is what hockey bot want it to be what it's so good and y'all know i am a ride or die for hockey bot so when i find a fragrance that's i feel like that's slowly better than it i'm like how it's not better because at the end of the day hockey bot wins it all because i still love hockey bot but it's like in that same val um realm and i love it so viva more was another one that they sent to me but i gifted it to a friend of mine the last fragrance that was gifted to me was from bdk perfumes so shout out to bdk for sending me this fragrance and they also sent me some samples let me go ahead and let y'all know what samples that they sent me first Ooh. so the first one is called passe soir and that was my first time smelling passe soir and let me just say i'm getting a bottle period <laughs> it is such a pretty girl fragrance it's like the epiphany of <sighs> of a pretty girl like i really like it it is so nice um and people usually always talk about passoir but i never smelled it until now um the next one is tuberose imperial now y'all this is what i want a tuberose fragrance to smell like if you guys ever smelled Le Beau by mfk now that is a rare find it is a tuberose fragrance from mfk um they discontinued it it was a limited edition and they discontinued it um my friend got it and she was able to send me a sample of it um if you ever smelled that one this is almost the same exact vibe i'm just saying what this right here is has to be my collection i have to get it i don't care i have to get it um, and then the next one is Cree Charnel that they sent to me. Now this one is one that my husband likes, but when we went to the fragrance, um, the Georgia fragrance event last weekend, he really loved the Extrait more than this one. So I feel like I might give him the Extrait um, instead of the regular one because he really liked that and i liked it on him as well and the last fragrance like to listen they're about to take these monies for me they're about to take all my money all my coins for real because i really want this one and it is called toback rose this is a beautiful rose fragrance it's so sexy y'all so sexy i have to get this in my collection so sexy but the and that was what they sent me in the samples and y'all like they knew not to send me samples because that was going to get me in so much trouble but here's the star of the show and they sent me ombre soprano this is a gorgeous spicy smoky ambery saffron fragrance now this one right here is exclusive for just bdk's website and i think Harrods, if i'm not mistaken it's an exclusive you really can't find it everywhere you'll have to get it at bdk alone y'all so sexy this smells like a sexy well-dressed man in a nice black rolls royce with leather interior just so sexy Oh my gosh like i cannot wait to wear this and i can't wait to sniff it on my husband too because y'all it's sexy and it lasts long because i sprayed it i'm um, just testing it out when i was getting it when i just got it and then i put it on my arm and i was just like wow this right here is a showstopper i could already tell this is about to be still in the girl's heart this fall and this winter time. all right you guys so now let's get into the fragrances it. that i bought now this one y'all have seen it before but i don't think i officially hauled it for y'all so i'm gonna show it to you guys anyways and it is eilish by billy eilish i recently got this um i want to say about a month and a half ago and you guys gorgeous gorgeous fragrance now my honest opinion now that i've used it a while i don't think it lasts that long it probably gives you a good five to six hours depending on how bad you spray but y'all already know i have my enhancer fragrances if y'all didn't see my enhancer video i'll put it right here for you guys i know how to enhance it after i realized that it doesn't last extra long 
I enhance it when I really want it to last long. I just love the silhouette of the woman's body right here. It's a really good fragrance. It's a really good fragrance, especially from a celebrity house. Like, it's super addictive. Like, if you're looking for a pretty, beautiful, addictive, ambery, sugary, tonka vibe type of fragrance, then this one is one that you need to have. And if you watch my enhancer video, then you will definitely enjoy this fragrance to the max. The next fragrance is one called Poppy and Barley. And I got this from the cosmetic store. It is by Jo Malone. This was actually my first Jo Malone fragrance. I found it for only, I wanna say $80. And when I smelled it, I fell in love. And I instantly bought it. I never really went and smelled Jo Malone fragrances like that, like that because people are always saying that the longevity sucks. But on me, y'all, this has got to be the long lasting Jo Malone fragrance I've smelled. This lasts a good seven hours on my skin and the sillage is what makes this fragrance even more prettier. Cause even if you don't smell it on you, the sillage is good and then every single time I move, I get whiffs of it. This has to be one of their longest lasting fragrances and this is just a cologne impression. I really enjoyed this fragrance. Um, if I can find another bottle at the cosmetic store, I will haul it again because first of all, it's a good price. And second of all, it's, it's a good fragrance, y'all. It is so unique, it stands out. I love, love, love this, this fragrance. another one from Jo Malone yeah. and I got it from the cosmetic store as well. And it is called Scarlet Poppy. Now you guys are very familiar with this. Now, y'all, these two layered together, it is good. I remember sharing these two fragrances with you guys for the vlogs, but not everybody watch vlogs. And I understand that and I respect that. So I wanted to share with you guys here. Scarlet Poppy is another one that I found at the cosmetic store for $80. Yo, it is a sweeter version of this. Um, they do have that poppy note in it that you can feel the vibes from. But when I tell you this is so good, I love this fragrance. It is so sexy. Um, this is very beautiful. And then, of course, look at the bottles. Jo Malone bottles are so pretty. I really like them. That's why I was very bummed when people said that they don't last. But these two definitely last on my skin. And if I were to ever have an issue with these two fragrances anyways, I know how to enhance the fragrance. So these are the two that I got from Jo Malone, and I'm really enjoying them. And the them. last fragrance um, that I have in this collective haul is one that my husband got me for our anniversary now um quick story time when we was going to the fragrance launch he said okay babe i know we're gonna go to the fragrance launch don't buy no fragrances because you know you can just get the fragrances the same fragrances at discounters and i said yeah i'm not planning on getting no fragrance um at all so when we got there we were sniffing and i was falling in love and i was writing down notes and just doing all that good stuff enjoying the whole event and I just kept going back to this specific fragrance. Well, these three specific fragrances. And um, towards the end of the event or the end of my time at the event, my husband was like, all right, babe. So since we're about to leave and I said, yeah, I'm getting ready to leave. And he was like, all right. So since it's a George Off event, go ahead and pick any fragrance from George Off and I got you. And he was like, as an anniversary gift. And I was like, oh my gosh, yay. So... I have found three fragrances, but out of the three, he only had one in stock. And I always wanted that luxury boutique style experience. So this one, there was three that I really couldn't decide on. And um, they were able to decide it on, on it for me because I did not want it shipped. I wanted it there that same day. So this one came home with me and it is from the Zherzhov Cosmodery line. And it is Bouquet I don't know. First of all, y'all, I love these bottles. I love the caps. I love everything about them. But can y'all give uh, it some love? Like, do you not see this red and this gold vibe that's going on here? I love it. Like, look at the bottle. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. I love it. And I like the fact that you can see the juice in there so I know how much I'd use. Because Lord knows, if I had, if I seen how much I use in the Lyra, I probably would stop using it. Because <laughs> I have the original formulation. I don't have the old, I don't have the new formulation. So I really like that fact that I have that. But y'all, this right here is the prettiest, prettiest vanilla, instancy, sweet, smoky, 
deep sensual fragrance I've smelled in a long time. It's so good. I was just so ecstatic. I was so happy. So not only did I have the goodie bags that they gave me throughout the event, my husband made sure that I walked out with a fragrance and I really like that. And that was one of my anniversary gifts. And that was it for the haul, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I will link everything in the description box below if I have any discounts. If you guys were to shop, you guys know that that helps the channel out as well by using my links. Of course, they are commission based. So if you want to support, go ahead. If you don't, just go ahead and Google it and you don't have to support, you know you can just watch and just buy it on your own terms but um that's gonna be down there for y'all if you need um i hope you guys enjoy this video don't forget to like comment subscribe if you made it this far go ahead and subscribe because at this point you love me and i love you too and we're family okay so go ahead and subscribe until we meet again please 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 stay safe and keep on smelling fragrances bye <laughs>